Well, I just realized that uh, a number of our members now are, are asking me questions about really they're not safe at home. Uh, you know, they're worried and they don't have money and they have a child and things like that. So I started looking around a little bit and uh, made a few phone calls. And uh, and here she's in Texas. So this is news. Texas has a family violence program. Uh, and if you go to this website, it's HHS. Dot, that's health and human service dot texas dot gov and, and it, it has all the programs that they have there and the one is the national domestic hotline now i just called them too and they're just sound like wonderful people and they're very careful when you answer the phone that can, are you able to talk and i said for a friend so they said yeah have her call us and it's easier for us to tell her where to go they can not only get her funding but also get her housing get her make her safe and a big thing was people using her computer you know uh that people are smart enough now to be able to say what you tell what you're doing on your computer and they recommend here uh about another organization that concentrates on that and it's called uh, tech, T-E-C-H, safety, S-A-F-E-T-Y dot org. They also have a hotline, too, and they tell you how to protect yourself that people are, are, are getting the information on your computer. So that's something to know, particularly if people are, are unsafe in their own home. I mean, that sounds... Um, <laughs> uh, you know, just dangerous to me. But uh, that, that hotline seems the place to go. Uh, and there's a national program, the Department of Health and Human Services, the Family Violence Protection and Services Program. Uh, so they provide shelter, uh, support, um, um, education, all kinds of things. Now, where is the Texas thing I want to get it? Because this is pretty laid out pretty well. Uh, what what is family violence? That's good. You know, physical abuse, sexual abuse, emotional abuse, financial abuse. All those things are family violence. Teen dating violence, uh, services for survivors of family violence. So you, it happened. Okay, temporary shelter is a hotline. Uh, here's a safe hotline. Legal assistance. She talked about free legal assistance a lot. We could get you free legal assistance, assistance in obtaining medical care, emergency transportation, training for help in seeking employment. Look at all those things. So you, you need to get a job. I mean, that's probably what a lot of people, they're not making money and they need help. Um, and so they, they help you get a job and everything, place to live, get a job or whatever. Uh, so this is, I think, very important. Uh, age of self -procure. Oh, also here, if you're looking for money to provide these services for people. So if you want to help other people, particularly if you've been through it and you know, or you're worried about it, you think it's helped, then you could apply for a grant. So you can get a grant <laughs> to provide these kind of services, you know, in your area for people. So it, it's not only, you know, helping people, uh, I mean, helping yourself if you're a victim, uh, but actually helping other victims too. Um, and so I'll put the links in the description uh, on that. And uh, I feel sorry for the, um, and it's mostly ladies. I haven't had a uh, guy tell it, but it could be either, either way. Um, and uh, they'll be in the description. So if you're watching this on YouTube, they're in the description. Uh, if not, just in Let's Go Help, just and tell us what you look for, what's the ER, and we'll put together sources for you. But the first thing to do is call that hotline. So here's the number here, the domestic violence hotline, 800-799-SAFE. 800-799-SAFE, okay? So if you know of anybody who may be a, um, a victim of, of domestic violence or yourself, you're worried about it or don't even know how to describe domestic violence, people, you know, that don't give you the money you think you should have. I mean, it's domestic violence, according to these. So there's laws now and you have to know the laws and, uh, and you can get free legal help for all that. So... Uh, know your rights, know the facts, and you get them from the expert, not from the person who's <laughs> violating you or a friend who doesn't know and is guessing. No, go to the expert. There's people here uh, that spend a lifetime studying these issues and knowing the laws and knowing your options. And that's what you have to do is know your options. And don't get your options from Mabel. It happened that Mabel may be right, may not be. You, you want ex expert advice, and this is how to get it for free. Okay.